now we're going to show how to perform uh, independent component analysis on uh, a raw EEG file. So we have raw EEG file in this case. So we go to a database montage, say common average database montage. Uh, we have this file, we can select uh, the, <coughs> uh, <coughs> the time window or we can simply go to analysis and we can compute uh, independent component spectra or on eyes open condition. We sim simply select eyes open condition. Uh, you have all channels listed here. Uh, you can make the upper spectral frequency less than 40, 64 hertz, which actually does, doesn't matter. But, uh, and then we just uh, click OK. And in this case, uh, the software will decompose EEG in eyes open condition into independent component. Uh, for each independent component, the program will compute spectra for each of four uh, second uh, time intervals. And it shows uh, the dynamic of this spectra over th uh, three minutes of recording. And then you can get the whole impression of uh, what are the components that can be separated in this patient and how they change in time. And let's see, usually it takes about uh, 100 iteration to perform the ICA decomposition. So now we have ICA components and the first one is uh, simply eye movements. Uh, eye blinks actually. <coughs> this is a component that corresponds to occipital alpha rhythm and uh, this is a component that is generated over the central area which was uh, deviant from normality in this patient and this is actually slow activity that is uh, generated in this patient and uh, then you can compute for this component you can com compute Loretta image so go to Loretta for the component click and you compute uh, as uh, Loretta uh, for this component, okay, three-dimensional image, but you can go also do as Loretta imaging. You have to download as Loretta. Uh, then you have to in view explorer. So we, we are continuing uh, computing uh, S Loretta and Loretta um, Im imaging. So we need to define uh, the job. And the job is characterized by the number of electrodes, sampling rate. And uh, we need to download uh, the electrode coordinate file as well as transformation matrix file. Uh, they must be computed separately and they are stored in separate in separate files so we download uh, this file and uh, simply you go to file then, then you need to open the file that corresponds to the potentials of uh, that you're going to compute as Loretta 4. This potential is located in the file Loretta folder. It's called VNEG Loretta Voltage. You open this file and then you, you compute this, uh, uh, this uh, as Loretta image. Okay, as you can see here, the three-dimensional slice view of the as Loretta image.